Well, hi there, I'm Fenwa. I'm Lost. I'm Demo Weasel. And welcome back to 007 Bloodstone for the PlayStation 3. More like Buttstone. Oh. Bond here. Good morning, 007. I know we promised you a week's holiday after Athens. But Why is she talking to him like, like as if someone's in the room there? I think she's looking down at a laptop or something. Oh. Later we'll see this scene from a different angle and it's somebody else there. It turns out there's been somebody uh, in every scene the entire time that we just never saw. Ah. It's James in a wheelchair. Yes. James Denob. Don't How be ridiculous. Do you know Midhurst Laboratories. Biotech firm, publicly traded city. Whoa. You can tell this is a Daniel Craig Bond game because it uses this exact uh, UI that I think Goldeneye also used. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Also, and I, I want to say that the movies use it too. This, this was developed by the developers of Fez. Yes. I understand. Good. Last week, one of their senior researchers, Malcolm Tedworth, went missing from his yacht in the English Channel. At first, the Royal Navy also, like, he was dead. what they, they, that sort of UI isn't practical at all for anything. It is practical for relaying information to us, no, the it's viewers. Not. <laughs> like, I, I'm just sort of imagining, uh, so, like, a secret agent looking at all this shit and going, like, ah, stop moving. Like, I need to read that. Go back there. It's like one of those PowerPoint presentations that people make that's not in PowerPoint. Yeah. No, it's it's showing us all the in, all the information that we need. But I want to know what James Bond's all about. Go back over there. Uh, James Bond is all about researcher, bioweapons, password. It might be a trap, a setup. Any chance that it's the researcher himself? Hang of conscience, second thoughts about selling out the UK? That's why the helicopter is landing outside your hotel. There'll be a jet waiting at the airport. And when you arrive in Istanbul, do whatever you have to, by any means necessary, to find out who's behind this. And make sure... That so here's my uh, assessment so far of this voice acting. Uh, Judy Dench knows how to voice act. Daniel Craig does not. That's fair. You don't hire Daniel Craig for his ability to act. Cool. Honestly, Daniel Craig does not need to voice act, considering... Oh. Uh, considering he's supposed to be a, essentially a faceless... Goon. Um, Power Good fantasy. Morning, let's make a uh, let's make a 007 that's not white or not a guy, and let's see how Idris many Alba. heads explode. Sacrilege! Ah, good. The signal when it went below ground, but you may be able to pick it up again once you get into the catacombs. Q branch and transmission. Uh, Tanner is one of the only other named uh, voice actors in this, uh, only because he also played Tanner in Quantum of Solace, Skyfall, and Goldeneye 007 for the Nintendo Wii. Did he throw his phone away just now? Stop. Where do you think you're going? Dr. Bond. British Museum. Architectural Heritage Foundation. Why would you use your, your like, actual now. last name? Because he doesn't care. He's got a bruise on his face. Yeah. I don't the lighting care. is just weird. Nobody goes down there without a hard hat. Of course. Safety first. <laughs> he puts it on and stuff immediately starts falling on his head. Like bricks and everything. This construction site marks the point we lost Tedworth's signal. We need to find out if he's still friendly or working with our enemies. Use your smartphone to search for evidence. Why is smartphone, smartphone with capital, a capital S? Yeah. That's right. Well, it was uh, it was 2010. Smartphones were still kind of a new novelty. Is this detective mode? Yeah, this is this is detective mode. Great. I assume that unlike uh, this, this is a pretty linear game, right? Oh yeah. Yeah. No, this is not an open world game in the slightest. Mm. Are there secret things that you can find for Achievos? Yes, there are. Mm. Such as uh, one of the other computers here, I believe. Oh, okay. We've cloned that computer's hard drive. I'll pass it on to our analysts. Continue searching the area. Are there documents that you could scan for precious lore? Yes. Why, yes, there James are. James Bond lore. Get, your, get yourself mm -hmm. some garbology. I'm so glad you can pick up novels which unlock concept art in the gallery in the main menu. Yes. Get in that crane and spin it around real fast. Over here, what is this? It's an old issue of Playboy. Wow. Look How at vintage. It. It's got titties. Dr. Bond, the foreman is ready to meet you. Please wait for him in the far cabin. Come this way. Where's your hard hat? Everybody's just very concerned about his lack of hard hat. Uh, yeah, once you're here, nobody actually cares, I guess. People should care. This is a working zone, goddammit. Honestly, the best thing right now would be just for James Bond to suffer some sort of head injury because he was too much of an egomaniac to follow instructions. 
or he gets arrested because one of the other workers actually called that number. Yes. Yeah. A brick falls in his head. Uh, he falls. Credits roll. <laughs> <laughs> it's a spider. Run. Ah, oh, fuck. What? Yeah! This seems like a waste of resources to both, like, trash their dig site and destroy this this trailer, trailer just to kill one man. It's a tragic accident. Woo! Hey, thankfully that was there. Listen, you gotta go all out if you wanna take out this guy. Whoa! The floor of that just popped in. The intruder has been dealt with. It's okay, they didn't see him. No, they didn't. How do they... how? Okay. I like how he, uh, his body went ragdoll after he was on the floor. He just gives up. We have to go check this thing out. I, I love the animation of James Bond running with the cell phone out also. Oh, he's got to make sure he's going in the right direction. Fucking Google Maps. You're right about the brightness of this being weird. Or rather, just like yeah. the brightness between the the um, UI and the environments. <laughs> for, okay, for a second when you ran up and like meleeed that guy... I saw, I thought that thing was the sort of the grind balance meter from Tony Hawk. <laughs> Welcome to this, the most standard of third person shooting environments. <laughs> I like that little leg kick he did. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta check Twitter here. Horny uh. on main. Uh, uh, what? T oh. What? Hmm. Okay. That looks ineffective. So the game distinguishes between what is a silent takedown and what is a not silent takedown. Mm -hmm. I think the only difference is that it changes whether the animation ends up with you standing where the enemy was or the enemy standing where you were, basically. Okay. Um, I don't think they really can hear the regular takedowns. Do our enemies alerted to noise? But they're alerted to noise, and there is a line of sight thing. Mm. Um, you can see now that, that when we're in the detective mode, you can see uh, uh, question marks above everybody's heads because they're uh, investigating. Uh, there's nothing in the melee takedown animations that indicates like exactly why they are unconscious or not moving after the fact. No, a lot of times it's just sort of like a karate chop to the back of the head kind of thing. But you know that's the way movies is. Yeah, I suppose. Oh. I expect different things, different things from video games, but this. This is a hallowed cinematic experience, mm -hmm. and I should be treating it as such. I'm so immersed. Mm -hmm. Why is that guy staring at that? He has to guard that glowy thing. What glowy thing? There's a guard right there. He's not even... Focus but oh. I like how you pivoted Take with that moving his feet. Oh, on the ends of these pipes. Yeah, I, I honestly don't think there's a way to do that silently because one of the guards is staring right at the guard that you have to take out. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Once you go loud enough, the loudness does not matter. No. That's right. Just like that uh, movie, Quiet Place. Ah, parkour. Yeah. Mirrors Bond. Shootable. I wish. Oh no, those things are heavy. It's okay, this is survivable. It's okay, he has MI6 training. Yeah, sure. Yeah, he, he brushed it off <laughs> his shoulders. Uh, dirt <laughs> off his shoulders. No, this is silly. Mm -hmm. Perhaps. Yeah, I feel like, like in general, video game Bond is indestructible in a way that movie Bond is not. I thought movie Bond was indestructible already. He at least, like, gets beat up and limps a little bit. Mm. Like, video game Bonds can jump off of a building. All right, movie Bond did that too, didn't he? You don't buy a video game to play as a weak James Bond. No. No, you buy a video game to play as a weak James Sunderland. I, I <laughs> buy it to, Yes, okay, great. I, I buy it to play as an odd job, of course. Hey, he's all yours. I'm not using a pair of pliers to pull out that guy's teeth. Okay, you're cool. But Topside said there was someone in that cabin. You can do him instead. Jesus. Someone do him? Oh no, they tortured that guy. So we, we talked about intel before, and this is kind of the first intel that the game more or less shows you how to get. So this is just what that looks like. S just a Cummins. Sounds like he had it just a Cummins. Uh, so I'm not going to to bother popping out to the UI for any more of those, but I will post them in the okay. thread. Okay. Or Tumblr post or wherever this, wherever this ends up. Mm-hmm.
Oh, uh, like uh, Lobster mentioned, at least uh, so far the locales have been varied, even if they're brown. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, we do see some other colors before the end of the game. Oh, do we, do we see green? Uh, we see white. Uh, like white as in snow, not just white as in people. people. <laughs> oh, don't walk near things like that. Yeah, I feel like uh, the way the way pretty much any room encounter starts is hiding around the first corner there and waiting for someone to walk up to you. <laughs> I just noticed the UI is in the Mass Effect font. Not the, um, the pro tips on top, but the, yeah. uh, the weapon indicator on the bottom. I thought that was just Microma, the, uh, the Hawks font. Hmm. I could be, mi- I could be mistaken, but... Maybe, uh, but you know Mass Effect could also use Microma? Yeah. What? Fonts can be used in different places. It's, it's the PlayStation, I want to say it's the PSP font. Uh, <laughs> it looks sort of like it. It's what you get when you want Bank Gothic yeah, with lowercase letters. I'm tired of being stuck in these tunnels. It shouldn't be too long now. Good. Sooner if you oh, it's snowing inside this mine. Yeah. It's just a little dusty. If you let the uh, oh, okay, that just answered my own question. I was gonna say if you let the conversation go long enough, do they just like leave? Yeah. And so if you're going for a, a more stealthy playthrough, that's kind of just how you enter rooms. You play this game without killing anybody. The alternative would be to just focus aim everybody. Like so. No. <laughs> Last guy was just so disappointed. Yeah. I like how the barrels glow so that you can blow them up. Hey, we got a trophy pot. Three birds, one bloodstone. That, that's the thing that people say. That's a normal human oh. being thing. Audio logs. Is it, is it going to have a guy going nuts? Oh, I just I can't stop this bond. Uh, you can't actually listen to the audio logs. You can only read about what is in the audio log. No, they're very slowly coming. <laughs> you sped them up, stupid! So I'm actually not sure what happens if that elevator actually reaches the bottom, because I did that every time. Okay, though, you get a trophy pop for it eventually. Look there at all is. these moving parts. Yeah. Wow. Mm-hmm. Again, after Wheelman. <laughs> this is so refreshing. Yeah. Oh, look it. They're, they're glowing. That's Jesus. right. I like how the explosives are highlighted even after they've been uh, tossed all over the place. Yes. They're still active. Oh, I know. Yeah. Like, when you when you blow up the first one, it just scatters the rest. It doesn't actually blow them up for some reason. Hey, there was one of them. Oh, there's more. <laughs> oh, no. It's okay. The map finally reset. And uh, we'll find out where this train is going next time. Excellent.